This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Hello and welcome back to channel Tea Lover. So if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to this channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. If you are totally new viewers on this channel, then our channel provides you the free domain, free hosting, free BCC card and many method how you can own the digital currency. If you got any problem related to any topic of my video or if you need any support regarding action approval or monetization, then you can directly contact on Tea Lover 2054 in the Instagram or you can join the Telegram channel from the link in the description below. Without wasting time, let's move for the today's content. In this video, I'll teach you how you can get the free RDP services. So if you are thinking how to get the free RDP services then this video will be very much important don't let it skip any part of this video as I have already made a number of video regarding this topic you can go through the my channel and you can get the free RDP server and this RDP server is totally windows RDP and you can create unlimited amount of free RDP server for the lifetime so please stay with me and get correct with me so that I can provide you the free services like this again in next video also so please subscribe to the channel and get connect with us okay besides this if you got any problem you can contact on tlover2054 in the instagram as i have shown in the screen and this is my website tloverofficial.com by which i'll just provided all the necessary link and all the required file in this website so please subscribe to this website also and let's begin for the today's topic to get the free rdb server okay so first of all to get the free rdb server you have to just go for the new tab and here you have to just go for the type github okay so please go for the website github and please open this and next website you need to get the free rdb server is ngrog this is the website link please go through this i'll just provide this both link in the description below you can go directly and i'll just provide it all the necessary file in my blog please go for the my blog to get all the necessary file okay first of all you have to just create an account on the github so we'll just create an account and this is the github you do not have to do nothing you have to just go for the sign up now please provide your email address go for this continue now you have to just create a password for this email please provide a strong password as you can see that we have just successfully set our password we'll just go for the continue now we have to just enter the unique username so we'll just keep as a steal of our free rdp as a unique name now you have to just go for this continue at last now your account will be activated just wait for a while before that you have to just verify this puzzle so please click over here and solve this recaps okay after you just solve this recaps I go for the summit and once you are done then you will able to get this github student pack but before that you need to verify your email so for that we'll just go for the gmail of our respective mail and if you just reload this page then you will find a mail from github and here will be the code of github copy this and you have to just paste in the github pack okay after you just paste over there you can just scroll down and you will just redirect to this welcome to github page okay please click for this just me student and go for this continue okay as you can see that you will be successfully able to get an account in the github okay now this is the github free plan just scroll down and go for the continue for free so finally you are in the dashboard of this github likewise we'll just create account in the ngrock also please go for the ngrock go for the sign up your creating account is very much simple you can just go for this continue with the google or you can just continue with our github student pack also just select for a respective mail and you will be able to create an account in the ngrock okay so please click on the i accept the term of services and go for the create an account now you can see that you can turn on this two factor authentication but you will just scroll down and go for this skip now we'll just click on the got it and we will be redirected to the dashboard of this website okay now you can see that we have fully signed up in this both pages and we are in the dashboard of this both website okay now we will start to get the free rdp services okay so first of all to get the free rdp you have to just go for the github now please click on this add option and now please go for the adding new repository now please give your name so now please provide a unique name this name should be very much unique so we'll just keep as a tea lover rdp you can keep any offer for example we have just used this name we'll just scroll down and go for the create and repository but before that you have to just go for the selecting this private option and go for the create repository and create an account okay finally you have created an account on this github now you have to just go for the setting scroll down then you will find an option for secret and variables please go for the secret and variable now you can find the action please click on this action once you go for the action then you will find this type of interface 
where you have to just click on the new repository in secret now you have to just provide your secret name okay so for the secret name you have to just go for my website and you have to just go for the latest tech news if you just scroll down there is a post that is rdp server please click for this now scroll down and you will find the code for this so please copy this option and Xerox authentication token please go for here and paste right over here now you need to put this cigarette code so we'll just find this cigarette code in this setup option so here in this ngrog dashboard please go for your authentication token and inside this here is your token number please copy this you can also copy this from here also okay after that you have to just go for this repository option and go for the pasting now you can see that we have just paste our secret key and the name so just scroll down and go for the add secret as you just added the secret you have to just go for this action button as you can see in the menu please click on this action now if you just click on the action then you have to just scroll down and you can see the option for set up a work yourself please click on this set up a workflow yourself now you have to just provide the code over here so for that you have to just go for my website and this is the code okay so please copy this code from here to here so please copy exactly now you have to just paste this code right over here as you just paste it over here just scroll down and after verifying everything is correct you can just go for this commit changes okay so please go for this commit changes so you have to do nothing please go for this commit changes now you can see that your main dot yml has been created okay now you have to just go for this action so you have to just wait up to five second or ten second here okay so please wait a while and after that please click on this action and after that you can see that your process is in queue okay as it begin for the in progress you have to just click on the ci option please click over it now we scroll down and just click on this create main dot yml and you have to just click over it okay as soon as you just click over there you can see the build option so please click on this build and you will find the cmd option like this okay so here your tunnel has been created okay now we will access for this free rdp now we'll just go for this ngrock website again now please scroll down and on the menu of this cloud edge we can found the endpoint so please click on this endpoint menu now you can find the id that has been activated since one minute okay so please click on this link once you just click on this link you can find the option of this url and this url should be copied okay so please copy this now go for this source and type for the remote desktop connection so there is the remote desktop connection please open it now please provide this copied code remove this part okay you have to just keep this address after 4.tcp okay so please go for this connect now they are connecting your pc so now you have to enter the credential so for that you have to just go for this my post you will find the user as runner admin please copy this as you see in the screen now please provide the username as runner admin now please provide the password also over here it is right over here okay so this is the password copy from here to here and just copy it now please provide this password over here okay so please paste it now please click on the remember me and go for the ok now it is connecting your remote desktop connection you have to just click on the yes now you will be able to access your free rdp service and it is just loading okay just wait for a while and this is your free rdb service which is ready okay as you can see that we have successfully got the free rdb services and here you can use this rdb services for the epic game launcher also unity hub also there is lot of facilities for this rdb service okay as you just see that this is a windows server and this is the windows server rdp which is 100 percent free for the lifetime okay so you have to just go for the setting so we'll just go for the setting and look for the configuration of this rdp okay so we'll just click on the setting so this is very much fast you can just check over here and this is the azure rdp as you can see over here and if you just scroll down and go for the my computer so we are in this pc option and you can see for the drive storage and if you just click on the computer and if you just click on the system property then you will know for this system configuration of this rdp okay if you just click over it your device specification will be there and here you are getting 8 gb of ram with the windows server 2022 data center and it is 100 percent authentic amd processor okay as you can see that you can get a lot of feature in this rdp which is lifetime and you can use this rdp until and unless you run this code on your browser okay this is how you can create a free rdp services as you can see that i have just opened this rdp services and if you just go for the google chrome also it is running very smoothly okay so this is how you can generate the free rdp services and i want to tell you that if you just skip a small part also then your rdp server will not 
accessible okay so please do not skip any part of this video and follow the exact method that i have done and i request you that please use the new gmail and new account so that you will signing in the account of rdp and ngrock with a new gmail so that all the thing will be assigned properly okay so please try with your new mail and you will 100% get this free rdp and if you got any problem any error please comment in the comment section below i am here to provide you the assistance for this any problem that you face regarding creating this rdp okay so this is how you can generate the free rdp servers of 8 gb where you can launch your pc games where you can use this rdp for monetization of facebook or any other purpose okay so this is how you can create the free rdp please subscribe to the channel to get more update like this i'll be again back with you bringing more content like this till then have a good day if you like the video please hit on the like option do not forget to click on the subscribe and bell icon for our latest update till our official channel will value for your support thanks for watching this video thank you